everybody, Anali here, and we are going to be starting our fourth episode of our Desiderata Valley Let's Play. We are going to be loading up the Jacques family, and just like the previous families, we will be playing the one remaining day in the season, and we will be kind of fixing up everybody's hobbies and interests, because once again, there seems to have been a problem with getting things correct. But that's okay, we're going to grab our box here. And we are going to start off here with Dad, also known as Marcel. He is a family sim, and of course he has rolled they want to have a baby right off the bat. We are going to click on that because I love baby sims. So let's come in here to his hobby enthusiasm. He's clearly supposed to have a one true hobby of cuisine, and he does not. So let's go ahead and fix that. Yeah, so it's nature right now for whatever reason. We're gonna fix that and make it cuisine. And then, oops, wrong button. And we also have this issue here where he has literally no interest in food. And so we're gonna take away a few points from entertainment there and add a few points to food just so it makes a little more sense. <clears throat> he is an Aquarius. He is really on the sloppy side pretty darn shy and very active and really playful and just slightly more on the grouchy side. Marcel loves food, but Sophia loves a fit man. Can he strike a balance between his love for delectable delights and his waistline? And as you can see here, he's actually really close to being like max fitness here. So hopefully we can just keep that up and everybody can be happy. All right. Now moving on to Sophia, we'll go into her hobby. Clearly her hobby is supposed to be fitness and for whatever reason, they have it set to music and dance. So we're gonna go ahead and fix that. And let's come up here. We are going to take a look at her bio. Sophia loves to work out. She has a pretty demanding job. Can she and her best friend Opal find time for themselves? in their busy schedules. Okay, so she, it, which I know we looked and it obviously showed that she was friends. So apparently her and Opal are best friends. So we need to make sure that they have time for each other. She is a Gemini. She's right in the middle of sloppy and neat. She's really outgoing. She's a little more on the active side and a lot more on the serious and grouchy side. And let's go move on to Violet, who we met in our last episode because she is close friends with Rick. Let's go ahead and check out her hobby enthusiasm, which is clearly meant to be sports. And yet again, it is not. For whatever reason, it is set to fitness, but we are going to fix that. And we are going to come in here and we are also going to fix the fact that she does not have interest in sports. So here we'll just take away some paranormal points and we will add some sports points. Now let's head over into her bio. Violet and Rick have been best friends forever, but Rick is going through some rough times. Can she help him understand his parents? Can she help his parents to understand him? Okay, so just like his bio mentioned her, her bio mentioned him. So obviously we are supposed to make something of their relationship, whether that be friends or more. She is a Leo, so she is a little bit more on the sloppy side, <clears throat> a little bit more outgoing, way more active, and more serious and grouchy. And let's just take a look here. She's not got a duplicate personality from either of her parents. She is a popularity sim and she wants to get a job in the athletic career. Okay, let's see. So we've got a want locked for him. We do not have a want here for her. She is also a popularity sim. She wants to make a friend, meet someone new, and she wants to kiss her husband. So. Clearly, I think that this is leading us towards having a baby. And then let's see, I think that, first I think we should probably get rid of this big old box here, because we do not need that anymore. 
And then I think we should see, yes, let's go find a job for Violet in the athletic career, because that sounds like a perfect fit for her. And let's see, have a little flirt. And then we're gonna bring them up here and see if we can have a baby. We are going to have a bunch of babies in our first round. I think this is, at the very least, I think this is baby number three, so long as it happens for them. Because we did try with our first household and they never were able to have a baby, so. Okay, so online job finder, dance career, look again. Let's come over here. Architecture, no. Let's see, politics, no, although she does have the want for that. I think that she is much more suited for the athletic career. Look again, and if for some reason it does not show up before the end, oh, there it is, never mind. I was gonna say, I do have a Monique's hacked computer and I could just use that in order to force her to get this career, but there it is. She now has a job in the athletic career. She will be needing a mechanical skill point. And there's a baby jingle. So that is definitely at least three babies we are gonna be having, yay. So she does have this want to go to college, but she has 12 days before she becomes an adult. So we're not gonna bother locking that in right now. She does want to gain a skill point though, and we will use that <clears throat> to gain a mechanical skill point. So let's study mechanical. And let's see, the dad is a fast food shift manager, and he needs a logic and a creativity. So let's go ahead and look around and see if we even have the means to gain these skills that we are needing. Um, let's see. It does not look like it. It looks like all we have are athletic equipment. All right. So, which he's got a creative skill point already. What is this? No, that's a bar. Um, yeah. Okay, so we're gonna have to grab him an easel. And they don't have a ton of money to spare, but I think we could do a cheap chessboard. I think we can get away with that. It is really going to be pushing it, though. So we'll have to just make sure and watch that. Okay, and so he actually will go to work today at five o'clock. So why don't we have him go practice some chess? And Violet is going to go practice her mechanical. What about Sophia? Let's see, she actually is a minor leaguer in the athletic career, so a body skill point is what she needs. So let's go ahead and come back upstairs. We'll have her use the bathroom. And once again, I'm not seeing anybody with a significant amount of cooking skill. Um, so we're just gonna have to make do, and that's okay. I think with him being in a culinary career, eventually he's going to have to gain some cooking skill points so maybe we'll kind of put that on him and see if we can get him to gain enough cooking skill points to not burn the house down very excited I tried that fitness okay so that's just telling us obviously we got the fitness as our one true hobby because we fixed it <laughs> and then he is down here he is going to play some chess 
and get that skill. I don't know if he's going to be able to get both skills by the time he has to go off to work. And even if he was able to do that, I don't know that he would still be in a good enough mood to get a promotion. Also, let me check. Okay, so he doesn't need friends. Neither does she. Neither does she. Okay. And Violet has gained her... Oh, that is the wrong action I just canceled. Let's try that again. She just gained her mechanical skill point, so we can be done with that. Oh, yikes. She does not have the best grades, though. So if she is thinking that she wants to go to college, she is definitely going to have to do better on her grades. I mean, and honestly, I don't, I don't think I hardly ever have a popularity sim, <laughs> sim that will make it all the way through college. Most of the time, they are far too busy making friends and doing things like that. They never actually graduate. Especially because I try to stick to like a more wants-based play style. I don't always. Sometimes if I really just want that sim to make it through college, um, then I will just force them to. But a lot of times if I'm going based on wants, popularity sims don't tend to make it all the way through college. But we can see. We'll see. Maybe she, maybe she can do it. Okay, so she needs to use the bathroom, and she needs to have fun. So how about you go ahead and go play on the computer? Let's see, and she has gained her body skill, but she probably could use a shower once her daughter is out of the bathroom. So let's go ahead and wait for that. No. You can get off of the internet. No, I don't know what you were doing, but you're not doing it now. Ah, I know what you were doing. We do not need to be doing that. Let's see. Oh, he wants to get a pet. I always have this problem where any time I have a family sim in a household, I always end up getting them a pet. Like, not every family needs to have a pet but I just think it's so cute. Okay, so let's have him make some lunch meat sandwiches because he can't burn the house down doing that. What is this? Let's see what this is. Okay, it is part of this soccer net. Although they actually do have a really nice sized yard and I think that we might actually be able to have a big dog. Let me see. How much would it cost? Hmm. So it's 500 for the dog house that's outdoors. And I want, I want the Chewy to go inside. And of course the food bowl would go inside as well. How much do they have still? Okay, so you know what? They probably can adopt a dog. They're definitely going to be low on funds again, but I think it's worth it because the pets are so cute in this game. I just love the pets. Let's see. Okay, where is she? She is hungry, so she is waiting. And of course she does not like the dog bone, so I'm assuming maybe she is not as happy to have a dog. Let's see, she wants to gain a mechanical skill point, which is interesting. I don't think that has anything to do with her job or anything. Let's see, we'll have her eat. We should have Violet come down and get something to eat as well. Actually, first we'll have her answer the phone. So long as she can make it there on time. I don't know if she'll make it down the stairs. Okay. Is Marcel available to talk? I don't know who that is, so we're going to say no. Let me look. Yeah, that's not even anybody that they know. Oh, she is actually going to go to work, so we'll just have to put that sandwich away for later. 
They're going to eat and have themselves a nice little conversation. Of course, they're going to have more conversation than eating happening. I swear one day I will install the mod to fix that. <laughs> Probably, maybe, hopefully. Okay, so he's finished eating. Although he's still fairly hungry, so he could probably go ahead and eat more. And I think she could probably eat more as well. Go ahead and have them continue their food and their conversation. Yeah, she is definitely needs to eat more. Which I'm guessing she must be having trouble keeping it up because she's pregnant. That's just the way it is. And then he needs to take a shower, and it looks like they only have one shower slash bath in the entire house. Because they have this little tiny bathroom down here that is just a toilet and a sink. So that may become a problem at some point. I don't know. We'll see. And he is, he's actually, he's only got 13 days before he becomes an elder. And so does she. Okay. Which is plenty, plenty of time. They can still have a baby. Let's see. Once he, oh, nope, he's going to have to go straight to work. What about her? When does she work? Okay, so she works at 8 a.m. Technically 9, but her carpool will arrive at 8. And she is still hungry. Oh my goodness. Okay, grab yet another sandwich. Hopefully he is going, yes, he is going out to go to work. Of course, the car is honking like crazy. There we go. He is off to work, and Violet is off at work. So we're just going to have Sophia here, and I think we're going to have her come up and take a shower. Actually, we'll have her use the bathroom and then take a shower. I've always found that that's a little bit more efficient. And then she, yeah, so she wants to gain a mechanical. She wants to talk to Violet. Let's see, when does Violet get off of work? It looks like she gets off at 6, so she'll be home soon. So maybe once she gets home they can have a nice little chat we are also going to have to figure out where exactly in this home we are going to put a baby crib because we are going to have to find a space for a baby let's see oh, there's Violet she has come home she wants to play soccer by a phone by a handheld game and invite someone over Okay, is Marcel, no, Marcel is at work, but she can, let's call and invite her friend over, because she has low social. Why don't you just invite him over? <clears throat> let's see. Okay, so that gave her that invite somebody over want. And let's see. She'll be able to fill up her social. Oh, that's what I was going to do. I'm just going to have her call and get the pet. Because he still has that, but when he gets off of work, it might reroll. So let's go ahead and adopt a puppy. And we're gonna go ahead, they have a big yard, so we're gonna get we're gonna get the bigger puppy. We'll go ahead and get Leroy. Are you sure you want to adopt Leroy? Yes, absolutely. Oh, let's see, we've got a chance card. The movie theater down the street just let out and Marcel's restaurant is packed. One might think they'd be full after those absurdly sized movie drinks, but no such luck. He's barking orders left and right when suddenly the unthinkable happens. The Uber Burger 3000 
breaks down in an entirely ungraceful puff of smoke. Now the restaurant smells like charcoal and there isn't a burger in sight. Should he try to keep going without the Uber burger or take the repair into his own hands? Oh boy, I don't want to get him fired. I don't think he has much in the way of mechanical skill. But they are, let's see, <laughs> we're going to go with who needs burgers. Let's see, who needs burgers anyway? While his staff out front is explaining the situation, Marcel makes an emergency run and begins preparing some of his ultra secret recipe veggie mite burgers. The ravenous hordes of customers are so hungry that they'll try anything. But once they've tried his burgers, they just can't get enough. When Marcel's manager, Jenny, arrives and sees the hundreds of happy customers, it's clear to her that Marcel's true calling is in the kitchen. Jenny pulls Marcel aside and helps him get a job as a host at a real sit-down dining establishment. Oh, yay! He got a promotion! We did good! Yay! Those always make me so nervous, because you never know if they're going to end up fired or what. Okay, Marcel has been promoted to host. So he got 242 today and a bonus of 484. Awesome. Yay. That's perfect. Okay, so we just invited our friend over too, and I'm not seeing. Oh, there he is. I was like, I know he should be here. Okay, so we're not going to mess with that. Oh, my lord, the flies in this house. Okay, so let's let the. Oh, do not lick that. Oh my god. No. Let's uh, get this cleaned up. That is atrocious. Okay, the new puppy is here and this wriggling pup needs a name. Okay, Leroy, we're just gonna stick with Leroy. That's what his name was and we're gonna stick with it. Oh gosh, no, don't lick, oh my gosh. Oh lord, that is that is disgusting. Okay, we're gonna move on from that, and we are going to fill up the puppy dog's bowl, and then we're going to. I guess we're gonna go ahead and let's see, is she hungry? No. We're gonna go ahead and send him upstairs to have a shower. empty his bladder need while we're at it and then I guess we'll just left leave him to his own devices just kind of let him be all right now she is going to hang out with her friend once she gets this puppy we're gonna gossip and we're gonna give a friendly hug and we're going to chat Not sure where she's oh goodness. Little glitch there, that's okay. Let's see. Other than that, he looks fine, so. Alright. Let's just have them chat a little bit, get her social up some. Maybe appreciate. Maybe a joke. Maybe they should play, let's play catch. Since she's a, you know, sporty sim, I think she'd play catch. And then he is in his daughter's room on her computer. Why don't you um, play on this computer that's maybe not in your teenage daughter's room? I think that'd be better. And we'll come over here and check on them. Of course, they seem to be getting along splendidly. She is going to have to use the bathroom. Playing catch should, I think, bring up the fun for her, though. Let's see. Of course, she's excited for sports. Oh, Lord. We have our garbage can knocked over. 
So we're going to have to pick that up. And we need to, I guess, carry our puppy up the stairs because he's not big enough. Let's see. There we go. Look at that cute little tiny puppy. So cute. And his food dish is nice and full. So how about, I guess, like, maybe we should play pool since I guess it's raining. They might not want to play catch. All right. Yeah. Have him join. They can play a nice little game of pool. Oh, look at that. She got a whole bunch in. Well, she must be really good at this game. I don't know, did he lose relationship because she did well? Oh, maybe they maybe they shouldn't play together then. I don't want them to to dislike each other over a game of pool. Uh we'll uh, we'll just see. Okay, there's a plus, so maybe maybe not. Maybe it was something else. And they're having a nice little conversation, playing their game together. The dad is kind of hungry, so I'm going to have him... We're going to have him just do a single plate of food. I don't know if it'll make it any less likely to catch on fire, but we'll see. Okay, and... Violet, let's see, Violet and Rick are still playing their game, although it is getting rather late. I'm going to assume that he's probably going to need to go home shortly. Oh, she got another one. Look at that. Was oh, she going to get that one too? Yep. Oh, what about that one? Oh, not quite. All right, so it's gonna be Rick's turn now. Let's see. Let's see if he can get get a good shot here. Oh yeah, there we go. He's got one. Can he do it again? No. Let's find out. It looks like Sophia has woken up. That's inconvenient because of the hour, but that's okay. Oh, I just missed whatever he did. All right, let's see. Can he do it? Oh, so close. So all she needs to do is get this one and this one in, and then she will win. And all he needs is to get that one and that one in, and he will win. So it's a pretty close game, really. Oh, but I think she might, I think she might have it. Oh no, so close. Let's see, can he do it? Can he get it in? Oh, I think so. Yup. One more to go. And he wins. Wow, I really thought she was going to win. I was wrong. Alright, let's take her upstairs. She, oh goodness. That is a mess. I'm assuming um, Sophia must have had a bout of morning sickness while we were down there. And she is actually hungry now, so we're going to go ahead and have her grab something to eat. And Marcel is pretty tired, so he can just go ahead and... No, you go... No, go eat. That is the one downside of ACR, is that they will sometimes just keep going back to the bed. Okay, so once she has cleaned that and gone to the bathroom and showered, we'll go ahead and send her to bed because it is really quite late. Oh my goodness, lightning. I really hope none of the trees catch on fire. Normally they put themselves out when it's raining and they catch fire, 
sometimes the rain will stop as soon as the tree catches fire and then the rain won't put the tree out and you'll have to call the fire department and hope that nobody catches fire in the meantime. And for some reason our little pupper is just sitting out in the rain. Oh my goodness. Well, I guess if he wants to be there. Let's see, is he? Okay, so he has a day still. He's not gonna grow up quite as quickly as our other puppy did in our previous episode. We only had him for like two hours and he grew up. Alright, gonna have her eat. And then she definitely needs to use the bathroom. And then I guess she can just relax, maybe? Because she went to bed way too early, way before everybody else. Okay. I know nobody's playing enough with the puppy. We're gonna have somebody make time for the puppy tomorrow. I want to make sure that her comfort doesn't go down too low. So she can maybe just hang out. Maybe she can daydream a little bit. And I wonder, actually. Oh, goodness. Where are we going? Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> She's being sick again. Okay. Oh, twice in a row. Wow. I don't see that very often, I swear. Okay. Are we good? Are we good? Oh, jeez. I don't think I've ever seen three times in a row. What the heck? I, I genuinely don't think I've ever seen that. That was crazy. Well, no wonder she's so uncomfortable. I most certainly would be. I hate being sick. Oh my goodness, that's terrible. I don't think I've ever seen three times in a row, ever. Oh, and of course, I'm putting her down to bed as soon as he gets up. Oh my goodness, I've got their schedules all kinds of off. Hopefully we can get that turned right around. Um, he actually is not going to be going to work today. She does have work. No? Okay, she doesn't. There we go. So she probably won't be going back to work until after she has the baby. And then she has school, of course. Alright, so the school bus will arrive for her in an hour. And... We'll take him down here and he can, actually, we'll have him serve some cereal in case his wife is hungry when she gets up from her rest. And then we'll come up here and we'll wake Violet up because she is going to have to go to school. <clears throat> oh, she wants to gain a skill point. She doesn't need any skill points, but we can always just have her work on something. And you're not going to have time for that. You're going to have to just eat at school. Okay, and let's see. Jeez, her comfort is really bad, but I don't blame her. I don't think I've ever seen a Sim throw up that many times. Not in a row, anyway. So he's just going to have his food and then we're gonna have him clean those up because yeah it's gonna be a problem let me double check this she has some neat she has even less neat than her mom we might end up just having to hire a maid for this particular household we'll see maybe they can keep on top of it okay let's put these leftovers away no, sir. Put the leftovers away in case your wife is hungry when she wakes up. There we go. Alrighty, and we have now finished our one remaining day in summer, and we have started the fall season with this family.
So I think this is a really good place to call it quits. Uh, thank you so much for anybody who has watched this far and like and subscribe if you are interested in seeing more of this content.